yesterday on a jailer at the Midland County Detention Center. He reportedly admitted to having sex with an inmate. Now today, the Midland County Sheriff sat down with News West 9 to talk about the incident. Jen Kastner met with Sheriff Gary Painter. We begin tonight with her report. News West 9 first confirmed this story yesterday when we learned that a 22 year old female jailer admitted to sleeping with a male inmate. It raised a lot of questions for us about whether or not anything would change inside of the Midland County Jail. Shakayla London is now out on bond, but just a few weeks ago, she was locked up in the very same jail she worked for. Court documents show the jailer admitted to engaging in sexual activity with a male inmate back in early January, and that it happened in the multi-purpose room. This after authorities were tipped off in mid-December that an inappropriate relationship may have been going on. We don't yet know if this was a one-time deal or something that had been carrying on for a while. This employee that was your employee, are you disappointed? I expected more from that individual. Give me your thoughts on this situation. I'm sure it makes you angry. It happened. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but this is one of your jailers. This is somebody that you're supposed to trust. Yeah. I mean, does it? are you going to change any of your procedures or any of your training because of this? No. We ask because the news raises questions and concerns surrounding the potential coercion inmates may face in these situations or the possible breaches in security these relationships can cause. We've seen examples of inmates and, and prison guards having a relationship and then the prison guards, you know, essentially will help the inmates escape. And that's something that's, again, I, I don't want to oversell this, not something that happens every day, but it's can happen. Sheriff Painter does not plan to use this situation in the jailer training program as an example of what not to do, nor will he alter or enhance any part of the jailer education process in light of it. People are trained. In their training, they receive information on the law. The law says you cannot have sex with an inmate. End of story. I cannot implant morals. I cannot implant personality. That's them. Around the nation, these types of stories are not uncommon. Sheriff Painter tells us it has happened at least once before in his jail. Shakela London is charged with improper sexual activity with somebody in custody. Now the next step for London is seeing whether or not a grand jury decides to indict her. Reporting in the studio, Jen Kastner, News West 9.